Hey, it's Danya, and welcome to another episode of the Next Level Spartan Show. Today's topic is show me your plan. Um, all of us, it's obviously important to set goals, and you've probably heard setting goals is very important since a very young age. But, and you've also probably heard that it's important to write these goals down. Okay. Now, even though I agree with you know writing these goals down to some extent. I'm not a big believer in you know putting it everywhere up and that so you can see it all the time because I believe if you're why behind your goals the purpose behind your goal remember there was an episode I did about purpose is stronger than object if your purpose behind your goal is strong enough then you wouldn't have to watch it every single day because you would be thinking about it every single day in any case but to come back about uh, you know showing me your plan is if you have a specific goal, you need to have a specific plan to get to that. Why is that important? We can all talk, a fancy talk, and say, listen, yeah, um, I want to, let's say, for instance, my biggest goal. My biggest goal is to, you know, um, see 50 countries before the age of 50. Now, how am I going to do that? What is my plan for that? Okay. It sounds very cool, and, and I'm being 100% honest. Um, only making this video now, I've thought about that even though that's been my life's goal, I haven't really got a specific plan for that. And I'm going to jump on that once I get off this video. I'm going to also jump on that and see exactly how I'm going to be able to, to achieve that goal. But let's say, for instance, we'll take weight loss as an example because that's what most people struggle with. Is you have to have a specific plan. Okay, You have to have a plan and saying, listen, yeah, for this week or for the next three to four weeks, I am going to attend a training session or a gym or do workouts at least three times a week because I haven't trained in two or three years or whatever so that's the plan I plan on eliminating these foods I plan on doing this and this and this the reason why you need to do that is because then someone that has more expertise than you in that specific area they could guide you they could show you listen yeah um, okay maybe I wouldn't do that now because you wouldn't be ready for that or maybe that's a little bit too much to try and do or maybe it's it's not enough maybe you need to push a little bit harder especially if you have a specific deadline you see a lot of us what we do is when you be when we goal set is we we almost set our goals too small we almost create our plan too small in a way not all of us some of us are crazy and, and they just do it too big like me <laughs> but um you want to you want to just look at that you need someone to, to guide you because if you create or the reason why you create these goals so small or the plans so small is because you're afraid of failing so you're making it a little bit easier for yourself so that at least you can obviously achieve that goal it comes back to that old saying of um, you know you have to reach for for the stars and if you don't make it you fall on the moon but if if you reach for the sky you'll probably fall on the ground Okay, so that's that's where that pretty much comes from. So it's very important. The main reason behind having a plan is so that you have someone that's more knowledgeable than you in that specific area that could guide you. That person can tell you, listen, yeah, this plan's going to work, yes, or maybe it's not going to work. Uh, maybe you need to change one or two things. But the only way that person can guide you and help you is if you actually have a plan and you can show them the plan. It's easy to talk a big talk. But actually having the plan, putting the plan down on paper, and then applying the plan or implementing the plan, that's where, where the next level results come from. But it all comes with preparation in the beginning. You need to create the plan first, which a lot of people are afraid of doing because guess what? It takes a little bit of work. So remember, if you want to achieve next level results in anything, in fitness and life, in business, in relationship, anything, you have to have a plan. You have to know exactly what your roadmap is going to look like to get think think of it as a treasure hunt what do you need to do what path do you need to follow to get from where you are today to the treasure that you want to ultimately achieve which is your goal okay that's it for today's episode remember to share this video with someone that might benefit from it um i want you to go to nextlevelspartan.com check out the website there if you haven't done so yet that's the blog where i share all this video and extra other articles um, and please share it with a friend. I want to create a big community of Next Level Spartans, which is all under SportCon, and you know, just help everyday people achieve next level results in fitness and life. Hope you have an awesome day. Thanks for watching this episode. Cheers.